Welcome to Bow Institute. This is Suite 300 entrance, which is more of a spa-like environment. Very relaxing. We like our clients to kind of come in here, look around. The colors are warm, very inviting, and decompress right here. We have the beautiful sound of a fountain trickling down, and we will put the numbing cream on them, give them a chance to unwind, offer them a beverage, have them just sit and read and wait for their appointment. Procedure room one is our main procedure room where we do um, not only procedures but most of the training. Really well lit. We love that. We have great, great natural light in this suite. So we're able to come in here and not only have our client be comfortable and they also have something really fun to look at up there. And here's our work table where we'll put our mannequins and the girls will be able to practice and get acquainted with the machine and the eyebrows and the drawing and begin their training program. And procedure room two, again, extremely well lit, windows wall to wall. Um, a little bit more of an Asian influence, I would say. Very warm, again, very inviting. We tried to really make everybody feel comfortable as soon as they walk in the door. Procedure room three, a little bit a little bit smaller. We have all natural daylight bulbs in here so we don't get any distortion of color when we're mixing color or even drawing it on. And um, Cozy, Bonnie, my assistant trainer, and uh, she's also a practitioner here, loves working in this room. Our main conference area is where everyone is seated um, when we're training during the theory segments of the class and also during uh, meals. The walls are filled with students. They can see the love of what we do in everything on the walls. We have um, photographs of our, of our graduates, actually our newest edition, which is The Evolution of Women, a painting by uh, William Cheval. And um, I felt that she was so appropriate for this space simply because you can see the women evolving very much like they do when they're coming in here to train in permanent makeup. They've already been completely proficient at, in another career and now they're coming in to learn something brand new. Women do have a way of evolving even well into their 50s and 60s and um, I think it just really kind of showed that and we just fell in love with her. We just had to have her in here. We also have the self-made man in the corner which again as soon as they come through the program they are presidents of their own companies and basically you're starting from scratch to build a practice to build a business. So the self-made man I think is very appropriate and indicative of the people coming through the program. Of course, men and women both take classes here. And then on this wall, we have some of the marketing. We have a whole marketing segment and we discuss basically how to communicate with editors, how to make a story newsworthy, and ultimately how to preserve that article once, once they do get it. And here's our other entrance suite. 400 so they can actually come in either door. This ends a little bit more hectic. Uh, that's why we kind of established the fountain area. Here's where uh, Danielle and Cindy and Vanessa are all working and answering phones and taking orders and shipping out. So this area is a little bit more hectic, but our busy days we do use both waiting areas. I tend to not buy art randomly. Something has to just, you know, strike a chord and really touch your heart. And uh, the picture with the butterflies is a gift for my sister, actually, and it's called Anything is Possible. And I, it was something, it was just simply a poster that I took and had custom mounted and matted and framed. And um, one of those things that inspire me 
and that I want also to inspire the people that are in the office.